Rosaria Elsa. I'm back outside again, and today we have another wrestling event for Combat Zone Wrestling in Blackwood, New Jersey for Proving Grounds. Super excited. Uh, we've got Aaron Ash taking on JD Drake after they had a little in-ring interaction a few shows ago. Griffin McCoy taking on Action Andretti. Um, very excited. It's going to be a great match. Fabu Andre coming back. Last time I saw him was in Maryland for CZW. Lot of great matches set up for tonight. Can't wait to see you guys there. Time to get ready and hit the road. All right, now I'm heading to meet up with Ryo and Mike Walker. Um, this is the look, fit check today. Did not have yellow, we're going with black. I like black, <laughs> can't go wrong. I'm just heading um, to meet the boys and then we'll be heading to Blackwood, New Jersey. It is so gorgeous, oh my gosh. Spring is really in the air now, and I'm so happy. On the road with Ryo. It's just us today. Mike is somewhere. Hopefully, he's on his way to New Jersey. <laughs> you guys had a show yesterday in D.C. How did that go? Uh, it was it was pretty good. It was for this festival. Um, it was a, like a 420 festival? Yeah, it was a 420 festival. There was like okay, okay. a lot of people there. There was like over 20,000 people. Oh, wow. And like we wrestle outdoors right, right now, I'm sunburned. Like if you see my wrist, like this is where my wrist, oh, wrestling table was. It's dang. Like, yeah, but everything else is super like, sunny. Like, my back is like killing me right now because like if the sun burns, if I touch it, uh, like it hurts. But uh, overall, it was a it was a great experience. Me, Michael Walker, and Action Ready, we had like a great match. Uh, like when we started wrestling, like a lot of people came through. Nice. Like nice. you wrestle on the outside, like usual. Oh, I, I saw, I saw yeah. some videos, a little moonsault off a little, was uh, it a bus or a truck? It was a bus. Okay, yeah. It was yeah. one of those hippie buses. Oh, nice. Yeah. Gotta love a hippie bus. <laughs> it's a beautiful sunny day. We've got our shades. We're chilling. Lovely ride. How far out are we? <laughs> uh, probably like about 30 minutes. 30 minutes out? Yeah. Cool. Well, see you guys there. Okay, we are pre proving grounds, and I'm here with Boom Harden. And someone got some new artwork on their body. Right. Oh. Yes, I dig your new artwork. Uh, oh, tell Here's us. Here's a better oh. angle of it. Ooh. Oh. Oh yes. Very cool. Okay, so what are those numbers? All right, so these numbers are actually me and my siblings' birthdays. My older sister was born August 11th. Uh -huh. I was born November 30th, and my little brother was born. August 30th. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah. And did you get this in Texas? Yes, I did. I was in Texas, in Austin, Texas, visiting some family. And on Wednesday, this past Wednesday, April 20th, I got a tattoo. And so I'm like a very observant person. So the first thing I saw when I saw him, I was like, did you get a tattoo? And he's like, I did. I was like, oh, we're vlogging. We wouldn't want to tell the whole world about it. <laughs> so thank you. You've got a match today. No, you don't have a match That's today. right. I don't have a match today. You're having a civil conversation? Yes, I'm having a civil, respectful, hopefully productive conversation with Mike Walker concerning our upcoming Urban Warfare match, CMD versus Mike Walker and Lindsay Dorado. We have a lot of hostility and we're gonna get to the root of things today. I personally don't know if it's gonna stay civil, but we'll, we'll see. Hey, don't doubt me. All right, I won't doubt you, but we'll have to see. About to get started. Super excited. I'm about to show you guys my little, my little setup here. I also have another job today. Ringing the bell. All right, we are at intermission. Uh, so far, so good tonight. I had one in-ring segment. Went really well uh, with Ryo. How I wouldn't have guessed. We rode together and we had a segment together. So fun. Now I'm just hanging out here. I got Will over here with me. Say hi to the ball now. We're on the vlog. Here's your winner, Lucky Ali.
Meat Proving Grounds. All done. Everybody get it. Tonight went really well. I'm heading home back to Maryland and I will be back at CZW next weekend for Limelight 5 and Happy Grace at the State Theater. See you guys there. Hope to catch you at the next vlog. Oh, there's oh, there's Gabby and Minnie for the vlog. Oh, and Aaron. Amazing. Oh, look at me. Look at you guys. I'm sorry. He did have a tough loss tonight. Like, subscribe. Beep. Like, subscribe, comment. And then hit the little bell thing in between. Yeah, the bell button. Bye. Um, this is not See you later, Ryu. This is why at Ryo we don't leave our cars unattended because then people like Mike can just get inside of it and take it. Hasta luego. <laughs> oh my god. Where's the car? Can you take it? Ah, that motherfucker. <laughs> Mike took it. I tried to stop him. I told him. <laughs> We're just gonna walk all the way to Virginia. Uh, all right, go ahead. Start, start, start walking. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Look, there's our ride. Uh oh, he's about to kill it. He's literally about to beat Mike Tav. <laughs> oh my God! What is this? Hi, Gabby. Hi. Oh my God! Stop. Yeah. Oh. yeah. Oh my God. We're having a street oh, fight now. Oh the Jesus. Sunburn. The sunburn. <laughs> All right, Ryo had his revenge. Now we're free. We're going home. I got my car stolen. <laughs> I was unbelievable. I couldn't believe my eyes. I was like, and I can't believe you were part of this too. That, <laughs> I, I treated him to a smoothie because I felt so bad for letting yeah, Mike steal his yeah, car. Broke my feelings. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you're my feelings. No, it's like a legit reaction from him. Was he was like, "Where's the car?" <laughs> that was mean. That was mean no, girl was tactics. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Um, do you want to talk about the clip that we were just talking about, or do you mm, not want to put that on the vlog? All right, so. <laughs> I just had a match, you know, like I had a, it was a pretty quick match. Like I showed my best moves and I did my pose and everything. But there was like one moment that hopefully not many people will find it. Well, now we're going to tell them. So they're probably going to look for it. Well, it is what it is. <laughs> See, that's, that's, that's my mentality. It is what it is. It is what it is. Uh, so yes, yeah, so I gave him like a wheelbarrow bulldog. And then as I was doing, going for the bulldog, this guy just pulled my tights and gave me the biggest wedge in the whole world. And I just landed. And as soon as I landed, I just like looking like an idiot, trying to fix my gear. Uh, so was... basically his gear was flossing. And <laughs> you can see the video. Home at last, CZW Proving Ground was a success. Shout out to everyone that I was with tonight. I had a great time as usual. No CZW after hours. I have work early in the morning, so I didn't want to stay super late. Aaron Ash has been dominating the CZW roster for a while now, but tonight he met his match in JD Drake. We're here with JD Drake at Proving Ground. You ended Aaron Ash's winning streak. I mean, if anyone was going to do it, it was going to be you. You came out going hard. Aaron, I understand that he's undefeated here at CZW. I understand that you were once the big man on campus here. And let's be honest, you're probably the most talented big guy in the locker room not named J.D. Drake. But what you let happen, you allowed that ego of yours to get bigger than your ass. All I did was come in and show you that there's always somebody better. Tonight, that just happened to be a man that's possessed and obsessed with success. Failure's not an option in the camp of the blue-collar badass, J.D. Drake. So don't take this as a loss, Aaron. Take this as a lesson. As long as you learn from it, you'll be on my level one day. Heard it here from J.D. Drake himself. I will be back next week with CZW for Limelight 5 at the State Theater in Habit Grace. Can't wait to see you guys there. Stay tuned, and I can't wait to see you guys at the next one.